On the legal front, anyway, we've seen Plexity and others in the news getting in a little bit of trouble about using, uh, improperly using robot.txt, potentially in their scraping of content in their LLMs. We've seen cease and desist orders. We've seen others licensing data, perhaps, to, for strategic reasons, to put pressure on others, as Richard uh, has talked about with, with some of us before the panel. I'm, I'm curious, Peter, what, what you think about this, and is there any parallels to the LinkedIn case, which I've heard you talk about a lot in the past? I think there are some. Uh, we know if we look at any website term of, terms of use, they all say you can't crawl, harvest, scrape, use robots.txt. 95% of websites say that, maybe more than that. And so we're in the early innings of, of what you just said, which is we know everyone's scraping and they're just, we know, so we know they're misappropriating the information. And what I mean by that is they're just taking it in violation of the terms of use. I mean, it seems pretty clear that that is happening. The question is, what will be the consequence? I just think it's too early to say. I guess there's, there's two possible solutions, and they're not mutually exclusive. One is just a commercial solution, right? There will be licensing arrangements where folks license, and so they're not misappropriating anymore. And then that, that whole LinkedIn part, that computer fraud and abuse act case that we worry about, which was you're misappropriating, that analysis will go by the wayside. The other, of course, is for the courts to figure it out. Just like with the, the high Q LinkedIn case, which took a long time to wind its way through district court in California, then the Court of Appeals in California, and then to the Supreme Court, this will take years to wind its way through our court system to get a real answer. My guess is you will get multiple conflicting answers, as you often do when something is new, from mid-level court, district courts around the country, as to whether or not the, the LLM scraping when in violation of the terms of use that prohibit robots txt constitutes a violation of some analog to the computer fraud and abuse act i just don't think we know yet but it's just based on what you're all saying and you're much more expert in the technology it seems pretty obvious it is right that that, that information is being misappropriated in violation of the terms of use but i guess if you apply that to the end of the earth then 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 a lot of llm is become the use case is undermined, and it's a con that doesn't seem like a realistic solution as much as I look at the law and I say, well, yeah, you're misappropriating.